Autodesk Inventor introduces radically superior ways to design in 3D. Breakthroughs in both assembly design and part modeling usher in a new era of dramatically easier to use, easier to learn design tools. Now that sounds a little fluffy to me too, so let me tell you specifically how Autodesk Inventor makes design and engineering easier. Let's start with something as simple as creating a sketch. You, know, you want to put down geometry as quickly as possible, and we want to help with that. With direct manipulation tools, we're putting the features right at the user's focus, right at the cursor. So take something as simple as the creation of a line. In most modeling applications, you have four distinct steps that occur in a serial process. First, create a line. Second, place a dimension. Third, edit the dimension. And fourth, manage the parameter name. With Autodesk Inventor, we make this process easier by allowing users to perform each of those tasks simultaneously within the context of a single command. Geometry created, dimension, parameter management, done, easy. That's the approach that we take with every aspect of design, whether it's plastic parts, steel frames, molded tool, or even cable harness. We provide engineers functionality to build gates, grills, ejection pins, all based on the function they're meant to perform, then have the geometry created automatically. Here's a simple example of bolted connection. Don't just put a bolt, nut, and washer into an assembly, put the right one in. Need help determining the right one? Use the calculator that's built into the bolted connection generator. How is all this possible, you ask? You see, we're not out to create just the best 3D modeling application in the world. Our aim is to provide engineers the tools that they need to solve their engineering challenges, challenges that we all face. How light can I make this part before it fails? When will it fail? And if it fails, how can I incorporate some of that information into my design? Have Inventor find the peak load of a mechanism while it's in motion and then transfer that load automatically to FEA. Use parametric optimization to figure out the thickness of a part while maintaining factor of safety requirements. Ah. A new era of dramatically easier to use design tools. Kind of hard to argue with, right? With Inventor 2012, it's easy.